What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough, the 2022, maybe 2023 edition. Okay, so it is finally time, guys, to actually go into the Pokemon Gym and take on Whitney because, well, there's no way around it. There really isn't. It's scary, yes, I know, but it has to be done. And, well, off screen, I did a few things. I did train my Pokemon up. And uh, Lucky is the only one to not get to level 20 because, well, we kind of want to see this right here on this walkthrough. Lucky evolving, and I got it close enough to actually evolve. Now, Togepri has been giving me some, uh... Togepri has been giving me some good uh, hits and everything else, so I'm kind of hoping that it would evolve too, especially with its high friendship and all that stuff. Uh, in fact, you know, a day, a few days came by... And let me see what the let me see if we can get another one of these guys to actually give it a haircut. So let's see. Uh, welcome, run the saloon. I'm the older brother of the two haircut brothers. You can make your Pokemon look for oh crap baskets. We don't even have enough money. Okay, so we'll be back for that uh, probably right after this battle right here. Okay, so if you guys are wondering what happened to my money, I've been spending a lot of money on the the sluts. Anywho. Here we are in the gym. The, uh, the gym leader is Whitney, obviously. It's a normal type gym, and it is infamous for one thing and one thing only, which we will get to in just a little bit. Now, talk to this guy. He's like, yo, champ in the making. This gym is a home to the normal type Pokemon trainers. I recommend you use a fighting type Pokemon. Yeah, we don't need a fighting type Pokemon. We're all about grits and, uh, and, and, and all that stuff. So, let's go ahead and battle a few people. Oh, are you cute little trainer? I like you, but I won't hold back. Okay, alrighty. Bring it on. Okay, so here is Victoria's Secret, and she will be coming out with a Sentrant. Now, normal type Pokemon may look like some pushovers and all that stuff, but in reality, these kinds of Pokemon are... Uh, these Pokemon tend to learn more moves, more elemental moves, just because they're normal type Pokemon. They... They're always underestimated in some type of way, and, uh, <laughs> well, I got one right here. Uh, sooner rather later it would be a fairy type, but yeah, I got one right here, and, uh, yeah. Thankfully, these guys don't know anything beyond tackle attack or anything, and that was a tackle, or that was a critical hit right there, so. Let's go again and take on the Sentret, and uh, there we go. And yes, we're trying to get Togepi to evolve, and, uh, well, Sentret coming out. Bring it on. Here we go, Sentrix. Time to get the swift attack right here. And that right there. Okay, so this is a this is a pretty strong Sentry right here. So let's see. Let's gamble a little. Let's go for Metronome. And this is a lick attack, and it doesn't affect Sentry. Good gravy. Okay. Yeah, good. Yeah, this is a uh, lick wasn't the move that I needed right now, and it, it has Fury Swipes. There we go, three, and there we go. Okay, so that's three hits. Now, this sentry is buffing up its defense, so we need to actually hit it pretty hard right now. Let's go, swift attack. Nearly defeating this guy, and here comes a fury swipe from sentry itself. Alrighty, and that's three for itself right there. So it's matching a uh, fury swipe for sw fury swipe, and there we go, sentry has been defeated. Bam! Togepri grows to level 21. Please evolve. I'm kind of hoping for that. Yes. There we go. And no, there is no evolution. Okay, so let's see. Wait, how much money do I have now? Oh, we got enough. Okay. So I'll be right back in just a little bit, guys. All right, we're back, baby. So we went and got a little haircut for Togepri. So hopefully it will be a lot more happier nowadays or something like that. We'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll see. But now it's time for Lucky to just get lucky and see if it actually evolves because, well, I got a little something waiting for some of these girls right here. If, you know, Lucky evolves and all that stuff. So, here we go. More battles. Okay, so here we go. Taking on Beauty, Samantha. Yeah, and here comes a Meowth. Alright, yeah, it's looking uh, pretty uh, slick right there. Does it like water type attacks? I don't know. Okay, scratch attack is going to hit us pretty hard right there, but guess what? Here comes a water gun attack. 
And as we all know, pussycats do not like it's a uh, they do not like water. But let's go ahead and try some slam attack right here. And that actually hits it pretty hard. So let's go one more time with the water gun attack right here. And oh my god, here we go. Water gun attack. For the win. And there goes Meow. And say hello to level 20. Yes, okay, so Lucky got lucky this episode. Let's go ahead and switch it out. Let's go for Chico now. Alright, Chico. It's all yours. Oh, wow, okay. So, Chico, let's get a Razor Leaf attack right here. And look at that. Meowth. Oh my god, I'm about to be defeated, and well, scratch attack right there, so here comes a Razor Leaf attack. And just like that, Meowth has been defeated. And well, we have defeated Beauty Samantha, and she's like, no! Oh Meowth, I'm so sorry. And just like that, Lucky is finally evolving. Well, it took us quite a few episodes, but we've done it. And, uh, well... Yeah! This Pokemon's getting a little stronger. So here we have Quagsire. Our buddy Quagsire. It's a pretty good Pokemon to actually have. So let's go ahead and take a look at new our new Pokemon, Quagsire, aka Lucky. So here he is, Grounded Water. Only has three moves. And, uh, well, now it is capable of doing something different right here because now that it has hands, we bought ourselves some Ice Punch. And, oh, this is the oomph we needed for Lucky. There we go. So there you have it, guys. We have Ice Punch, and, uh, well, we got, ro wow, we got Roll Out here. Yeah, I completely forgot about this thing. Hmm. Who should I teach it to? I could teach it to, oh, you know what? It makes sense. All right, let's go with Roll Out. Let's go ahead and use Roll Out for this guy right here. Take away Tail Whip. And there we go. Okay. And you know what? Let's go ahead and use Dig. And let's give this Pokemon. Let's give it to Serpentera because, well, Mudslap did its thing, but it's uh, it's still, you know, it's still something. And yeah, we kind of need Screech for this one. So let's go ahead and take away Mudslap. Give it dig, and it actually has a chance to to help us out in the long run right here, especially when with the challenge that we're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna be going up ahead. And well, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, Chico. Let's go right ahead and go with Chico at the very top. And well, is there a no? There's a female trainer right here, so. Let's try and battle all these girls and get some money because <laughs> we're deeply in depth. Okay, so let's go right ahead here. And there she is. How's it going? Don't let my Pokemon's cute looks fool you. They can whip you. Well, we'll see about that. And, well, here we have Last Carry wanting to battle. And she is sending out Snubble. Alright, Snubble. What's up? How's it going? Here's Chico. Chico, let's go with the Razor Leaf attack right here. And... Well, that was a pretty good hit right there. And here comes a Charm attack. So this right here is going to mess us up just a tad bit because, well, it lowers his, uh... It lowers our, our physical attack by a lot. And, wow, critical hit right there. That That's considered a critical hit for me. And Carrie has been defeated. And that's some more monies right there. Alrighty, bring it on. Every single one of yes. How's it going? I like cute Pokemon better than strong Pokemon. But I have strong and cute Pokemon. Okay, alrighty. So, here we go. Last Bridget wants the battle and she's coming out with a Jigglypuff. Well, let's go Chico. Time to do your thing right here. Let's go, you know what, let's, let's start off with a Fury Cutter. She has two Pokemon, and this, okay, so we kind of may, we may have messed this up, or, okay. I was about to say, we may have screwed ourselves a little, because, well, you know, seeing can't prevent the Fury Cutter from getting stronger, and, oh, almost finished it, and, 
Yes, okay, so we didn't get hit again. There we go. And just like that, Jigglypuff has been defeated. And, well, we're going to continue with this Fury Cutter right here. Alright, let's see. Let's go with the Fury Cutter. It's invincible now. Nobody can stop it, including this Jigglypuff. Yes, okay. Kind of like Rollout. Fury Cutter does the same thing. And, oh wow, Chico is trying to learn Synthesis. Well, I wish I could teach it that, but I kind of like its moveset right now. I, I would rather learn Mega Drain or something like that, so yeah, we're going to keep everything uh, still. And, well, here comes another Jigglypuff. And, well, oh my god, we missed, okay. Alright, so that right there messed us up, so we're going to have to go with Razor Leaf. I have a feeling this Jigglypuff will want to put us to sleep. And, oh my god, almost did it. Okay, so here we go. Let's finish it off. And that is how you do it. Say goodbye to Jigglypuff and bam. Okay. So we defeated Bridget. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Okay, so before I do anything, guys, I'm going to heal up my Pokemon because this one's going to be intense. So I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, so here we are back in the game, guys, and well, it is finally time to take on Whitney herself. So, Whitney, infamous for one thing and one thing only, and that is uh, her mill tank. So, let's go right ahead and do this. Hi, I'm Whitney. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You want to battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. Yeah. How good are you? I just want to see. So, here we go, guys. Taking on Leader Whitney, and she will be coming out with a Clefairy right here. Level 18. So, thankfully, we have trained for this whole thing right here. And we're going to use something against her. We're going to use her own weapon against her. Here comes a double slap. There we go. Yes, we're going to be using the rollout against her. <laughs> it doesn't feel so good, huh? No, it doesn't. Okay, so here comes a double slap. And, uh, well, yeah, we're going to keep on getting whipped right here. Okay, stop hitting me. Damn. Come on, Lucky. Here we go. Roll out, and we miss. Good gravy. Okay, so, <laughs> it was good while it lasted. I was kind of hoping that, like, it would make this Pokemon faint, and then next thing you know, we roll into, uh, what was it called, uh, Mill Tank, but, yeah, that's not going to happen right there. And as you can see, this Pokemon has been slapping us like crazy. But the rollout attack wins it right here. And, well, here is the Pokemon that it, she is most infamous for. I am going to stick right here because, well, again, I'm going to be using her own weapon against her. So here is a stomp attack. And that nearly, oh my god, nearly crap baskets. Okay. Okay, time to ice punch this Pokemon, and yeah, never mind. Wow, Mill Tank. Why, why, why are you so mean? So let's go right ahead and go to Plan B. Poison Powder. And are you friggin' serious? You see, this is the reason why you shouldn't have a total sausage fest on your team. And yes, oh no! Oh crap, baskets! Come on! And here comes that rollout attack. And, uh, come on, come on. Oh, oh, wow, okay. Come on! Here comes a rollout attack again, and this one's gonna get a little crazier. It's in love with this Pokemon. And, damn it! Okay. Let's go right ahead and switch out to another Pokemon. Serpentera right here. Oh, my God. Now, we do have a move that can actually prevent this thing, but this rollout's gonna get crazier. And, yes, it's not very effective, especially against Steel-type Pokemon. And, uh, look at that. Our quick law worked. This thing's gonna miss. Suck on those lemons right there. Suck on those lemons again. And here comes the Dig Attack. Serpentera. Oh, yes. Let's go with the Dig Attack again, because, look. It's a Rock-type move. You're not gonna be hitting me hard. That's right. I got a Steel-type Pokemon. How about that? How about that? And, yes, yeah, so we're going to keep on making you miss. Here we go. Oh, my God. Critical hit. So, let's go with a Screech. Yes. Okay. Alrighty. And, oh. 
Completely forgot about the milk drink attack. Never really had that happen. So let's go ahead and um, take a rollout. See, not that strong. I feel invincible. And uh, yes, invincible I am going to be with this. Dig attack and here comes a rollout attack. Yeah, not so powerful. Rock type does not hurt. Steel type, suck on those lemons. Yes. And here comes the dig attack. And that takes care of Miltang. Serpentera, I could kiss you right now. Yes. Okay, so that is another way to defeat this girl. And she's like, Sob, what? You're mean. You shouldn't be so serious, you you child, you. Oh, wow, she's she's literally getting on my case right now. Okay, what? <laughs> oh, wow, she's crying. So, <laughs> you meanie. All right, going to walk away from this. And, oh, well. Oh no, you made Whitney cry! It's okay, she'll stop soon. She always cries when she loses. Okay, so... Sniff. What? Oh, what do you want? A badge? Oh, right, I forgot. Here's the plane badge. <sighs> Throwing out the peace sign, guys. That's right. The plane badge lets your Pokémon use strength outside of battle. It also boosts your Pokémon speed. Oh, and you can have this too. Yes, we get ourselves the TM-45, or 45, which is probably a track, right? Yes, it is a track, and yes, it, just like it did in the game, it attracts the Pokemon of the opposite sex, and it renders them useless. Kind of like me. Alright, um, yeah, you're cute, yeah. Ah, that was a good cry. Come for a visit again, bye-bye! Alrighty, okay! So, yeah, three badges, and I can't get out of here, oh wow. One way in, no way out. That's kind of what it is. Okay. So, look at that. So, we won another badge. It's pretty awesome, guys. I am I'm actually happy about that. And, well, what does this guy have to say? Uh, you won! Great! I was busy admiring the ladies here. Well, good for you, homeboy. Alrighty. So, with that being said, guys, I have a very, very special surprise for you. In the next episode, you better not miss it, because, uh, we got another trade. And this trade is going to happen because, well, I sort of maybe just probably caught a specific Pokemon in Pokemon Gold. And maybe, just maybe, I bred that Pokemon. And I maybe, just maybe, just maybe want to send it here to add to the dynamic of this team, so... In the next episode, guys, do not miss it because we have a trade coming in. You do not want to miss who I trade for. I'll see you guys in the next episode. If you guys want to make a donation to this channel, heart button right there. You know, links in the description. And, uh, yeah, if you want to join the channel, you know, for the exclusive stuff like Pokemon Crystal, the walkthrough for members only, sign up right there and I'll... And you'll get the walkthroughs right there, I guess. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next episode as we see this trade. See you guys.